Hello, today I'm going to talk about 86 radioactive Jesco Guvadiol and uh, he has three saskimons, four star weak foot, left footed, he is six foot one, high high work rates and his bite type it is high average and it's his playstyle so he didn't change any playstyles so it is the same playstyles like the, like the gold version card so he has block plus, power header, pink pass, long pass and then jockey and let's see his stats. His pace looks alright. Good defending and also good physicality. And for sure I'm gonna give him a shout out because he needs that boost at pace and also at sprint speed. And also I want to increase his defending. I'm going to use formation 4 2 3 one I'm gonna play him center back, stay back. And then I'm gonna try him as left back, stay back. And uh, let's see how good is this card from Manchester City. Jacques is good. He moves well. Good. Let's see how reacting that time. And nothing there. Good interception. Let's see his long pass. Decent. Sure, I gotta try him again. Let's see this time. Gavadio. Okay, so he doesn't win headers. But let's try to score with him because he feels good on the ball. For sure. Let's see Gavadio. No. Let's try again. And I lost the ball. Let's see. Gavadio takes the ball really fast so he doesn't sleep on the pitch which is nice and good pass let's see how we react in this situation let's see if he goes to Konya and switch to him and this happens okay so I didn't do anything with him I want to see how we react and this is how we react so we switch to him automatic Let's see Gavadia. Let's try to shoot with him from there. 82 shot power and it's a crossbar. Come on. Come on. Hmm. Good interception. So he position well there. Good job. Really good job. Good one, Gavadio. So, no foul there. Good interception again, Gavadio. Let's try to run with him. And that's the ball. Let's see how he reacts in this situation. And he didn't intercept the ball, but it was a good offside trap. Okay, so this is how it reacts. So he goes to play us on, which is nice. Let's see, Gavadio. Okay, he didn't stay really well on the player. Let's try to take the ball. I like his 10 tackles, I'm telling you. I really like, like, <laughs> I don't know what kind of animation he has in game, but I like it. Good interception. Let's see, Gavadio. Let's see your head up. And we score with him. Let's go, Gavadio. And the opponent will rage quit. I see now, right now. No way. Nice goal from Gavadio. Good interception. Let's see. He's long pass again. Good one. His pace looks alright. Um, for sure, I'm gonna try to score with him. Ah, <laughs> so close! Good one, Gavadia. I didn't have to control him to take that ball. 
So here's some AI stuff that you will not uh, notice every time. No, no. Uh, he takes the ball really fast. And he lost the balance with Nani. Okay. And it's a penalty. Let's see. We can score with Guvadio there. He is. 66. 66 penalty. I'm gonna try to score with him on the left side for sure. And we score with him. Let's go. Okay, so this is how react is. So ball, the ball goes to there. To the, that player, he was close to him, but he kind of, kind of distanced him. I don't know why. Nice one. In three matches, I scored in two goals, and I'm telling you, this center back is good to use him as a manually. Uh, he is good as auto defending, but when you use him as manually, he is insane. And uh, let's talk about his uh, cross. It is his acceleration, his defending. I love his animation game, his tentacle animation choice. It is right. And also, I love his jockey a lot. So, his jockey, it is insane. And. Uh, I like his physicality, he is aggressive player and his strength is good as well and his jumping. His cons about this card of course will be his balance, you will notice when you play with him as left back. And uh, his work rates, he has high high work rates, sometimes he's go forward but it is not a big deal. And the way you should play him left back or center back, well I recommend to you to play him with him as center back. Because as left back, he doesn't have enough ex agility and spring speed. For the value, I think it is a bit expensive, but if he gets under 100k, maybe he'll be the best choice for him. And the question is, is he better than his evolutions? Of course, it is better than his evolutions. And uh, it is a bit worth it. And uh, as still is, I'm gonna give him... A plus for sure. He is a good center, but, but if he had the better reactions, composure, and a little bit sprint speed, maybe he'll become an S tier. But he's an A plus. That's all. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe and like. Have a good day, and see you next time.